welcome back to the Ranch Doctor Uptown here. Uh, today I'm going to bring you a gun that you guys have seen a number of times, but I've never actually done a review on it. Uh, this would be the uh, first uh, firearm that I ever bought. What it is is a uh, Colt, uh, the Combat Commander, and the uh, Commander series is a uh, four and a quarter inch barrel and uh, the uh, the combat commanders are a steel frame whereas the commanders are an aluminum frame uh, another way to uh, tell that is when you go to the serial number you'll get either a uh, 70 with a two-letter combination or an 80 with a two-letter combination uh, depending on what pattern pistol it is this particular one is a 70 uh, BS which stands for blued steel uh, you can also have SS, which stands for stainless steel, and LW, which stands for lightweight, and uh, should also just be a commander instead of a combat commander. Uh, like I say, on both sides, you're inscribed uh, Colt's combat commander model, and then here, combat commander model. Uh, the one thing that is unusual about this one, and not so much anymore, but uh, particularly when this one was produced uh, in the late 70s, is this one is in uh, 9 millimeter Luger whereas um, your common uh, particularly on your older pistols your uh, common loading was uh, 45 ACP uh, like I say nothing particularly special about this one standard GI sights um, does have the uh, polished uh, commander style hammer instead of the uh, spur hammer like most uh, and uh, arch mainspring housing on the uh, commander models where they have uh, gone with the uh, the commander hammer you'll also notice that the uh, spur on the grip safety is uh, abbreviated uh, but beyond that uh, like I say uh, pretty typical uh, appearing 1911 for the most part uh, as I said, this is the uh, first handgun I bought. Um, this was purchased in uh, the early 80s. And uh, it was purchased at the time when uh, the military was in the process of testing for uh, whether they were going to continue with the... Uh, well, they were wanting to get away from the uh, 45 ACP, not necessarily the 1911, but... Uh, this particular one was one of the ones that uh, was used during the testing uh, when they uh, were testing for the 9mm round. And um, obviously uh, the Beretta won out on those. Now I've heard that uh, sometime in the future they're going to uh, retest here and uh, whether uh, they'll go back to 45 ACP or not is yet to be determined. I guess that's uh, one of those things. But uh, for a uh, nearly 40 year old gun uh, it's in pretty good shape uh, it's pretty much been a safe queen over the last 10 or so years uh, you will notice a little bit of uh, front strap wear there where it's kind of starting to the bluing is kind of turning a purple color but uh, beyond that it's uh, totally stocked the way it came Anyway, uh, this is a pistol that, uh, like I say, you guys have seen before, but uh, I've never done a review on. So uh, that's the uh, Colt Combat Commander in 9mm. I hope you guys find this interesting. We'll talk to you later. You have a good day.